this is the frugal streamer and i have another video for you and i want to talk about probably the best budget option for a game capture card out there this is a usb capture card by avermedia this is the live gamer ultra s this thing is a beast for the price that you get let's look at this store right now let's how much is this thing right now you can get the live gamer ultra s 4k hdmi capture card in this color in black it also comes in white for 129 dollars on avermedia's website and i believe that price also translates over to amazon this thing is a beast for that price I do not think you can find a capture card that is equivalent for this for this price. 4K60 pass through, 4K60 capture, up to 240 FPS capture and ultra wide support. So 3440 by 1440p is supported by this. It is a very simple USB capture, very easy to set up. It comes with a USB C to A cable. It is a USB type, USB 3.0 to uh, gen one so that you have a you need to make sure you have that port available but you also have a hdmi input and output for uh hdmi pass through it does come with hdmi 2.0 cable so you don't have to worry about that which is also nice this looks very nice i think it's well built now obviously it's fully plastic it's very light but it feels solid and it's made out of recycled materials. And I think it looks really nice. They've actually given you these little red highlights on the inside, which looks pretty sick. Uh, this thing is uh, subtle enough that it's not gonna uh, look crazy on your desktop, but at the same time, it's got some pretty good look to it. And it's also got a little rubber feet on the bottom, so you don't have to worry about it sliding around anywhere. I'd like to show you some uh, gameplay capture using this and also uh, a very unique use case for this because this also supports vertical video at 4K60 and I have the Obsbot Tail 2 which captures vertical 4K60 so I think this will be an interesting use case for you to see not only can you use this for game capture but you can use this for a really high-end camera and it'll do quite well so let's now show you that you are now watching the recently captured gameplay that was captured by the Avermedia Live Gamer Ultra S into my broadcast app, Meld Studio. Now, this is captured at 1440p 60, and it's passed through to my 1440p display at 144 hertz. It's a pretty basic setup for the PC, and, uh, you know, there's no noticeable latency at all, which is what, what I really like about it. Also, another thing I really like about the Ultra S is just how simple it was to set up and how reliable it is. Now, since plugging it in back in March, I've had zero issues with the card at all. I mean, there's literally nothing. It just works. It's simple to plug in, it's plug and play, and there's no drivers needed. The image is crisp, no tearing, and with it supporting so many protocols, I'm pretty sure you will be able to get nice video and audio capture for your game or camera, no matter what you have. Over here on me, on me. He's coming around, I think. Got him. Sweet. GG. Yeah, GG. Good job, guys. In 4K 60 capture on the Avermedia Live Gamer Ultra S, but it is capturing my Ops Bot Tail 2, which is sending out a 4K 60 over HDMI. So you can kind of get an idea of what this looks like. Now, this is a tracking camera, so that, you know, everything should be looking pretty smooth as far as that goes, um, you know, and there's no jury. I mean, uh, I'm looking at the preview on Meld Studio and it, you know, it, it looks good. Um, it's nice and smooth, uh, looks great. Uh, hopefully the capture reflects the same smoothness that I'm seeing in the preview. Uh, but yeah, I mean, everything looks good. And, uh, you know, you can kind of see uh, what it looks like. Uh, 4K 60 smoothness. Uh, now, this is a really cool thing because one of the neat things that you can do with the Obsbot Tail 2 is you can capture in vertical. So let's uh, switch this to vertical now. Let's see if the Avermedia catches it and, sh and shifts it over. And there you go. So now this is 4K60 
full resolution, non-cropped with the camera. And uh, I mean, it's yeah, that's it's it's doing everything. It's it's there. Uh, this is what it looks like. And uh, yeah, it's a cool camera, right? I mean, really neat. And the fact that you can now have a capture card that can process vertical cameras for vertical content, vertical streaming, like on YouTube, which is what I've been doing a lot. Um, this works out really good for you. Again, $130, right? For a capture card that will do this, will give you 4K60 uh, resolution with devices like this and you know and it won't cost you a lot i mean that's a really good price for Aver media so yeah hat, hats off to Aver media really i'm be honest i love this capture card and i haven't even i don't even really use their embedded software with the you know this the streaming center and uh and such because i mean i you know obviously i use obs and mill studio which are you know much better options uh, but that does give you the option they do have a embedded software which i will uh, do a separate video on i will run and do a stream center video and also show you the 5.1 again this does that if you use obs and use the you can download the plugin or if you use their stream center uh, it does also have that built in uh, with the capture card. But uh, you know, yeah, good job, guys. Good job. I really appreciate what they have done with this by keeping something really simple. And that's what I like about them because, you know, I bought their uh, their live their live streamer 4K uh, capture card for my camera. Fell in love with it because it was simple. It was easy and it did not break. I like Avermedia Media products. They've always been good to me. And, you know, they're some of the best out there. So anyway, thank you again, Avermedia Media, for that. I do appreciate it. Listen, if you got any questions about the Avermedia Media uh, Live Gamer Ultra S or there any of their other capture solutions, I like I said, I have their camera capture card too. Again, I love it. So please, if you do, drop a comment down below. Also, subscribe to the channel if you like content like this. And click that bell for notifications. You'll know when I have a video goes live. All right, everybody. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. We'll see you later.